Protests in Ukraine's capital, Kiev, turned violent Sunday as opposition groups react to new anti-protest laws designed to criminalize pretty much everything the opposition has been doing for the last two months. The new laws ban things like setting up tents or stages in public places. The opposition has been camped out in the city's main square for months. The laws also ban protesters from wearing helmets and masks like the bright orange helmets used for protection in previous scraps with the police. Reporters on the scene Sunday said a small group out of the tens of thousands of people protesting have begun attacking police. This video shows protesters bashing a police bus, which was later burned. The protesters have been very aggressive here. They were throwing uh, some fireworks uh, and they have clashed with the police. We actually have video of them kidnapping at least one policeman. Some of the protesters have even made moves to storm parliament. So far, police have acted with restraint and haven't made any drastic moves against the protesters. But the New York Times reports no one seems to have any control over the situation. Opposition leaders denounced the participants in the melee as provocateurs and said they did not represent the aspirations of the peaceful protesters. But the leaders were also powerless to stop the fighting. One of those opposition leaders, former heavyweight boxing champion Vitaly Klitschko, tried to stop the attacks on police and was doused with a fire extinguisher for his trouble. Early reports estimate around 100 people have been injured in the clash so far, with attacks on police continuing overnight. For Newsy, I'm Jamal Andrus.